Well, here we are at the docks. A race for Alaska. Teams are in doing their last minute preparations before taking off tomorrow. Got a couple uh, support boats over here. One uh, rib with a uh, pop-up tent there on the back platform. And uh, we got some guys here uh, tightening up a bob stay. There's the Empress. And uh, you can see the pedals here, different apparatuses to propel them. See the boat over there, the yellow one. He's got a couple, couple seats there that uh, he sits on to, to go. And uh, everybody's got some way to, a lot of pedal power to uh, go when the wind is down. So here's some contraptions, a chain and a belt, and then a foil with a propeller. And uh, all these guys have a little different approach. These guys have a large uh, nozzle on their prop. Um, so they uh, have a tandem bicycle. And then they can lower their uh, prop in the water here. They got a nozzle around it. And then there's the tandem bike so they can get two people yeah. going on it. Looks like they have a cable type shaft, kind of similar to like a, a weed eater. And uh, here's another boat. This guy I believe is Solo on this trimaran. Similar, it's got a prop in, straight shaft. And then we have a few uh, folks that are rowing. So in a craft like this, and uh, there's a bigger boat here, and they have their propulsion on the side. Looks like some uh, oh, uh, pedals that they can lower over the side, and then their prop is on the back. And uh, so you get the idea. It's many different ways. And uh, here's a... Uh, Looks like a regular uh, ocean uh, kayak uh, team uh, Zen Dog. And then uh, here's another rowing craft right here. You can see he's got uh, some provisions in that that case. And uh, here's a team. Uh, uh, packaging up all their stores for the trip. Um, there's a couple, uh, couple people that can pedal there and uh, filling up on water. See all their their food and some drinks. Looks like a little ginger ale in case somebody gets seasick. And. Uh, Here's some more boats all lined up. Here's another boat, small sail boat, open craft. Here's one that's a uh, tandem. I do not know where they store all their provisions. <laughs> so, pretty festive, uh, pretty festive down here tonight. And uh, tomorrow's the start. Well, here's some more boats the other side of the marina. Here, I think this is the largest boat in the fleet. I just noticed uh, they got some tape on their forward hatch, so I think they must have found a uh, leak. Um, so this is a, one of the larger uh, trimarans right here. And uh, you can see they're doing a tandem... Uh, bicycle for their propulsion and uh, these guys here they got the single bicycle and uh, a paddle wheel uh, set up there with some two by fours 
that's a nice boat to be drilling extra holes in, but you got to do what you got to do. These guys here are getting ready to go. You guys look like you're going to win it. <laughs> All right. And there's a Ranger 20. There's a really nice hand uh, uh, wood boat. It's really nice. Big oars. There's a boat. That's their starboard prop. And then uh, here's a setup here. They got the prop off of a outboard bracket. And uh, and here's a. I'm not sure what they call this. Is this a rowboat with uh, sponsons, but uh, the masts look like they're carbon fiber masts. There's another uh, couple rowboats over there. And uh, and there's a Cal 20 there, the last ones to come in tonight. So that's uh, the fleet. These guys are been working on their... Uh, rigging they had one mast down the other day they're doing something so uh and here's a boat they're filling up their uh water and doing a second pass through their tools and supplies you see their anchor strapped on the the bow and uh, a lot of water fresh water Here's some more uh, seats that look custom made for the guys that are rowing. So that's the that's the wrap up here.